In your 17 court watch now, an appellate court has upheld the sentence of a man convicted of driving drunk and causing a head-on crash that killed two Taft women. Investigators say back in 2019, 38-year-old Vincent Morioki drank multiple beers and a few swigs of whiskey before driving on Taft Highway, reaching speeds of 99 miles per hour. 50-year-old Raylene Sorensen and 20-year-old Reagan Sorensen were killed in that crash. The appellate court's ruling means Morioki will continue to serve his prison term of 30 years to life.